Well, hi, everybody, and welcome to Gator Talk. I'm Ranger Nate. Today, we're visiting some of Georgia Aquarium's newest animals, the American alligators. You know, gators are like my second cousins. <laughs> you like them from a distance. The American alligator is the largest reptile in North America. You might be thinking, what is a reptile? A reptile is a kind of animal that relies on the sun for warmth, has scaly skin, lays eggs, and has a backbone. Animals like turtles, lizards, snakes, crocodiles, and alligators are all examples of reptiles. American alligators are found in freshwater areas across the southeastern United States. That's because they like warm, swampy places. So they live in states like Alabama, Arkansas, North Carolina, South Carolina, Florida, Georgia, Louisiana, Mississippi, Oklahoma, and Texas. Now take a look at their teeth. What do you think alligators eat? The answer is almost anything they can catch. They eat turtles, fish, even birds if they can catch them. At Georgia Aquarium, we feed them special reptile biscuits along with chicken and fish to make sure they get all the nutrients they need to stay healthy. You may notice that some of these alligators look a little different. These all white alligators are albino, which means their skin doesn't have any melanin. Melanin gives skin, hair, and feathers different shades. Albino alligators are very rare. They don't survive long in the wild because they don't blend into their surroundings. Notice how the other alligators are darker in color? Being a darker shade helps alligators easily blend into what's around them. Not having that darker color can make it very hard to hunt and hide from other predators. Even though albino alligators look different from the alligators you're used to seeing, they are the same species. Did you know the American alligator was once close to extinction? Alligators were hunted so much that they almost didn't even exist anymore. But people noticed their numbers were getting smaller and smaller, so they put protections on alligators. Those protections and the help from a lot of zoos and aquariums helped save American alligators. Today, gators are a conservation success story and are not at risk of extinction because they're no longer endangered. Once again, I'm Ranger Nate, and thank you for watching Gator Talk. Be sure to download our coloring sheet from the link below.